welcome 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 okay we are gonna do taurus we're gonna do week three may week three taurus 2021 taurus 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 week three, please. That's one too many. Week three, current energy. Taurus, please. What he or she is thinking about you. Currently, you're... No. Currently, what I want to say is that you're in masculine energy. You know, take take this how it resonates, though. How she, how he or she is feeling. So you do have a masculine energy here. Okay. That is upset, drinking a lot, or really upset in their emotions. You have the Empress upright and the Six of Cups. So I don't know if there's two men here. If you ask me, you could be dealing with an Aries energy or you're coming in as Aries. <sighs> He's staring right at her. Reminiscing about the past, thinking about the past, emotional about the past. Possible, oh, oh, um, what you don't see coming. And the Empress is, is Taurus energy, right? So, take it as it resonates. Seven of Pence, trying to make a decision outcome high priestess reversed five of pence that's your challenge queen of pence upright current past <clears throat> which you know could be two weeks ago two days ago two hours ago so it looks like you or somebody was in the process of manifesting. Put it well. Here's the thing: this means something is already around that you already currently manifested. Somebody thought they were gonna have some type of win here. Okay. Now he's just staring over here, probably all up in his emotions. Thinking about an empress, a wife, a mother figure, kid's mother, something with the past, reminiscent. Okay. What you're not seeing right now is somebody is really not liking where they're investing their time. Because um, it's, it's the two of swords with the seven of pence. Like his head's down, like, oh, did I really do this? He or she, you know. Not wanting to see something. Knowing somebody had to make a decision. And the possible outcome, you have the high priestess reversed, not really using your intuition, not going within. It could be secrets revealed. You do have the queen of pens here sitting all pretty. And with the five of pens reversed, I mean, coming out, you know, on its side like that, that's, that's a challenge. So somebody is missing someone. I don't know if we have two women. It possibly looks like one man. That's all in his emotions. Thinking about what's the what's next what do i do so let's go to current past real quick because here's the deal you already had something in the palm of your hands i don't know if you let it slip away king of swords ten of pence so this could be somebody who's dealing with a family situation someone who's extremely detached i mean this could be a lawyer too getting involved with money but seeing now five of swords you have a masculine here i mean if you're dating then it's multiple men 
But I look at this as there was already a masculine that manifested. He already had something in the palm of his hands. And it's almost like he's too concentrated on his money or his family. Tell me about the current energy, King of Wands. But it's, it's almost like there was a major battle there. Like something didn't go in someone's direction. So, yeah, see, it was a battle. Somebody thought they were going to win and be victorious in the situation. And currently, they still do. But see, currently, someone is still like, this masculine energy, his stance is high. Like, almost doesn't want to budge, but almost like, hey, I had something in the palm of my hands, but yet. I really don't see much going on. I don't know if something, an argument, or you're feeling left out. Like, because you got the five of pens over here. It's almost like somebody thought, yeah, see, like feeling trapped. Somebody thought, you know, grass was greener on the other side, maybe. Like, who knows? Maybe somebody took a better job thinking that's, you know, it was more money. But they thought it was a better job just because it was more money. And it just, it w I almost feel like this energy blocked something they manifested. This combination could be a huge ego. But this is also someone who can't stop thinking about somebody. So here she is thinking, you know, um, could be two two energies. This could be a couple, two people that were together. Yeah, see, Ten of Swords, the star, trying to heal from a, a situation that didn't work out. Um, but this is also something you or them, someone chose to hang on to. With the Ten of Swords, you know? So, yeah, this is healing energy. Um, this is somebody who wants a new start. Possibly somebody who's religious, spiritual. You got the Fool, the Star, and Temperance. So, currently between two people and Empress, King of Cups, whomever you're dealing with, is obviously going through a rough time. But it's it's like the masculine feels stabbed in the back or they stab somebody in the back. Like, oh, I had this chance to go in a different direction. I didn't take it. Queen of Swords. Can't stop thinking about somebody. So you have a masculine here that's dealing with somebody. Um, monarchy or just... Um, a wife, somebody, and it's like, to me, they can't stop thinking about someone else. It's almost like holding on to something that wasn't worth holding on to. Because this is like, oh, man, why? Why did I miss out on this opportunity? Because it's like they had something in the palm of their hands. So what you don't see coming, now this is somebody reevaluating what they want. Yeah, see, this is somebody that's kind of going within, like, battling. How do I put the work in? What do I do? See, because this was like a block. This is somebody who allowed games, competition, arguments, juggling. This is somebody who... Looks like they invested in the wrong situation, but also their fault, not wanting to see something, um, choosing not to see something. This could be putting something on hold, competition on hold, putting something on hold because they were juggling. But this is what you don't see coming. So there's, there's, someone wants to put more work into something and someone's like, no, nope, I'm done with the arguing, I'm laying it to rest. You know, I want nothing to do with this. Looks like feelings may have possibly gotten revealed. And then you have the king of, and the queen. So this is a court couple. It's the secrets come out. Someone's been holding back feelings. Someone's really upset about the regret, how something went down. And this energy is missing this energy. Now 
Normally, I would say this is husband and wife, but that does not feel husband and wife. This could be a future partner. See, so maybe it is husband and wife. You get the emperor right here too. But it's almost like turning the back trying to figure out what do I do next in the midst of healing. See, there was, there was probably someone else. Um, or you're just meeting someone else. There was definitely something karmic here. And someone's walking away from it, changing their perspective. So it, it's almost like it looks like the truth gets revealed about a situation. Or you could have walked... Hmm, no, it doesn't feel like that. Talking, conversating, waiting for an email, hovering. So I don't know if you stopped conversation with somebody. I like you. Okay, so see that made sense that it didn't feel like husband and wife. Because the emperor's right here and he has husband and wife. This might be a current partner or your boss, somebody you run into. It, it's just like a perfect match. So I don't I don't know if somebody was juggling a situation. I don't know. Something's going to go in your direction, though. Like, something fair is going to go in your, in your direction. So I don't know if you walked away from somebody, you changed your mind, you didn't want to be involved. Or they're, they're done juggling. Now you have a feminine that's changing her mind. The emperor kind of turns the back, and now we're trying to figure out what's next. So basically, at one point, someone had something in the palm of their hands. They were too focused on, you asked me, this is the wrong things. Possibly money. There's no soul here. Okay, there's no, there's no, nothing here with cups. There's no heart. And now somebody's like, I can't believe I fought for this. Or I went towards this. Or I, I exhausted my energy with this when I could have been victorious in a different situation. I do feel more or less this is ego. Now you have an energy, a masculine that's really upset, bent out of shape, possibly crying, just hurt emotions, was in was dealing or is still dealing, and you're you're unaware of it, with somebody from the past. They could have kids with them and more or less it, it's like they're shooting themselves in the foot, their ass, I don't know that saying for for not seeing something. Because now this one all of a sudden turned real cold. Invested in the wrong thing. Not wanting to see something. But it looks like right now somebody wants to put the work into a situation. But it is, you ask me, it's kind of being blocked. No one wants to, no one wants to argue anymore. And nobody wants to deal with it. And then over here, it's like the perfect match is about to come in. Or you already know this person. Someone's going to come in and reveal how they feel. And then you're going to have to make a decision. To me, this is somebody who let you walk away or you walked away. And now they're like, fuck, why did I do that? So now you have this energy coming at you trying to figure out what, you know, what do I do next? All right, so you have adversity, it's time to push through and then purpose. I accept the challenges are the best way to learn. Well, the challenge right now is that you're really missing somebody. There's lack. Do you realize there's no cups here? It's almost like a one-sided situation. Like you were in a marriage, you were in some type of investment that did not make you happy at all. There was somebody else that liked someone else. Really wants to talk to them again, waiting for an email. So it looks like you guys are them. Someone cut you off. You know, and you realize you're in the midst of a challenge. Here's the thing. I don't see anybody taking this challenge on yet, okay? This is all like, what the heck type energy. But they they are. You know, this is somebody who's going to reveal their feelings. 
Um, at one point, you had to have been real happy with somebody because you almost made it to the Ten of Cups, but it wasn't enough, probably because all this was going down. But whatever marriage or situation you were in did not, is not working. Did not, is not. It's just, it's not. And it looks like it's about to be blocked. Too much arguing, too much shit going on. Someone could be considering divorce right here. Or this is somebody who walked away or let you walk away because they were still in something karmic and now they're like, shit, what the fuck did I do? Yeah, see, justice and death, there's a good chance there's some type of divorce coming to an end. Um, or this was a karmic relationship coming to an end and now the same energy is like, how do I get back here? You know? So... I will finish this on the other side. I will see you guys on Patreon. If you're new, welcome, welcome, welcome. Um, you can have all 12 extendeds for $2 a week on Patreon. Okay, I'm doing it for my little Patreon crew. But besides that, you can pretty much see the overall energy. There's something that's ending. This is, I, I can't believe I had something in the palm of my hands and I let it slip. I let ego get in the way. I let my past get in the way. And, and now this person, like, for real is just like, oh, my God. And it's almost learning, too. Like, everything's a challenge. But, like, at the same time, like, uh, there's there's no love there. There's no happiness. This is not a wish. Could be an Aquarian energy. This is somebody that's, like, this was somebody who was guided to go in another direction, spiritually guided, and they, they didn't listen to their own gut. Situation like that. Blocking this. Let me just put one card over here. So now somebody wants to invest elsewhere. There's a block here, though. Now that somebody wants to put the work in, you know. The butterfly relationship evolving, going to the next phase. So there is what you don't, you know, see is somebody is blocking a situation so something else can move forward. Someone now wants to put that effort in. I don't know if you want to put the effort in, though, anymore. Yeah, see, sabotage, rebuild, and working on it. I think you were in a repetitive situation. You weren't having it, you know. Now this person really wants to come back and, and fix something. So ultimately, it's, it's going to be up to you when this person decides to roll back around. I don't quite see anybody rolling back around this week, but it's definitely lingering. All right, y'all. See you on Patreon. Love ya. Bye.